puppy delivery we are going to look at a lot of things today this is the dad dog outside waiting for the impregnated wife to finish and now we see and one is out already but it's showing a sign of little weakness like we said in our previous lecture about the fading puppy syndrome though she is trying to lick up all the stuff around her now we are going to start what we call CPR that is cardiopulmonary resuscitation as we do though the puppy was a kind of weak so we are going to kind of achieve 30 compression in the chest at least making a full total cycle you see she's back and slowly as we do the compression at least 10 compression in a cycle is going to kind of create a good chance for the lungs to come back to life yes as we are achieving it you see these are the process but why is the puppy weak because of a lot of fluid inside you see the fluid and this fluid will go and pack inside the lungs and preventing the exchange of gas like oxygen and all that and you see once this thing blocked there it's going to kind of lead to suffocation and subsequently a kind of atelectasis as we mentioned before in our previous video this is going to or prevent breathing and once there is no breathing the tendency that the puppy is going to survive is low okay now we have finally achieved our aim by resuscitating and bringing this beautiful bouncing baby girl back to life and it's time to take her back to her mother at least to take some circle and to also know what is happening to her mother too Well, let's look at what we have here the breast of the mother which seems to be very very saggy though she's not that old to herself and so why we didn't allow the puppies to suck is because of one the saggy breast it might not really be okay to force it into the mouth until we finally ascertain that the breast is healthy but for now we are preparing artificial supplementary feeding like milk folic acid and glucose yes they need energy though she's still straining okay um it's something that we need to put close eye at you see you see this is just the process of delivery after 58 to 62 days mm -hmm. you see all over is just to pull up the milk and finish it alone by yourself so we are doing artificial feeding one so that the mother will have time so we will say okay what about the colostrum yes this can also serve as a supplementary or artificial colostrum especially when the proper supplement or nutrient are well mixed yes and you see proper nutrient I mean is you see when you mix make sure you keep the water warm and we are feeding them because the mother's breast is a kind of saggy and um, we suspect there must be or might be a bad milk lay down um that's just the thing and we we don't want to risk anything definitely we want to keep all of them alive until we ascertain the milk flow is proper mm, it doesn't want to give anybody see even if it's coming out from the nose but we are being careful too, too. 